My name is Brett Olson and I'm a safety application engineer with SICK. Today I'm going to be talking about the features and benefits of our new safety relay, the Reline. So right away, as you can see, we have a new design for the relay. It's a slimmer profile from the front. And then as you can see from the top, it doesn't stick out as far. So this can really help you with your design of your cabinet. You can save costs because you don't have to design as big of a cabinet now. Another great feature that we have is the quick release from the DIN rail. So as you can see at the top here, there is a little switch. And if you just pull that back, you can easily pull it off your DIN rail. We also have a little railing here so that they can connect together very easily so they won't be wiggling around very much. And this can be really nice for changing out your different relays. It's not very hard to take off the DIN rail. Another benefit that we have is the new wiring. So at the bottom, all of our wire terminals are now spring terminals at the bottom. So this can be really nice because when you uh, take your wire, you just have to put a small screwdriver in the top there and then just plug in your wire. Another great benefit of the new wiring is if something were to happen to your safety relay, you can just take out your wire terminal and then you can get a new relay and then plug it in really easily. So it's not very hard uh, and you also don't have to lose the wiring and rewire it. So now I'm gonna take you over to the setup I have. So right here, as you can see, I have two light curtains to the left and then I have it hooked up with a four pin cable and that is going with flying leads to the back of this OSSD2. So as you can see, there are LED lights right there and this is really nice for complete diagnostics. So there is an LED light for every single wire terminal. So as you can see, I have the A1 and the A2 are hooked up to 24 volts and zero volts respectively. And then I have a jumper between S1 and R1 for an automatic reset within the safety relay. And then I have both safety inputs, I1 and I2, are connected to the OSSD wires of the cable. So if you're watching the LED lights, as I put my arm through, both LED lights go off for the I1 and I2. When I take it back, it automatically resets and the lights go back on. There they go off, and now they're back on. Another great benefit of the Relay is a fast response time. With 10 millisecond response time, you can improve your safety distance calculation. If you have any further questions about the Relay, please contact your SICK rep or a safety MAE. Thank you for watching.